Okay, back here at the Vancouver Resource Investment Congress 2018. I've got Mickey Fulp, the mercenary geologist. And I want to talk a little mining sector. How you doing, Mickey? I'm doing well, Rob. All right, we've got a show here. Pre-reg is up. A lot of people in here, 330 plus companies. Uh, you got a, a dollar that's on the way down. You got a pretty good gold market. Let's kind of break down the sector. It looks pretty healthy to me. How do you view it? How do you view it? Well, I'd say so. Uh, the attendance is way up on this show. There's so many booths, they turn people away. Uh, we got moved outside to the... Uh, We're one of them. <laughs> to the uh, uh, concourse, which is fine. We get a lot of traffic out there. So uh, I think the mining sector's back, or the junior exploration and mining sector. It's back. Yeah. Um, as far as the environment goes here, we've, uh, we obviously cover these things in our, in our weekly. Um, how do you kind of view the health of gold right now? The health of gold. Uh, gold's up, it's up on the year, usually goes up this time of year. Uh, it's up something on the order, say, from, from a year ago, December, or, uh, or even a year over year, it's up something uh, well over 10%. So we got to be happy with that. If it's going higher or not, I don't know. I think it really depends on the U.S. dollar. A lot of this has been driven by a weaker U.S. dollar in 2017. Gold was up 10 or 11 percent. The U.S. dollar was down 9 or 10 percent. So it's been very much tracking uh, the U.S. dollar for quite some time, uh, basically since Trump was elected. So um, obviously uh, these equities here are probably a, a good way to make some money. How do you identify a good equity around here? <laughs> well, you look at share structure, people, projects, cash in the bank or ability to raise cash with very little dilution. So, uh, you know, everybody's got a story here. Most of them are mining in the stock market and you got to separate the uh, the wheat from the chaff, if you will, and pro probably 90% of these companies will fail in plus or minus five years. Or get, and by fail, I mean they get rolled back or they go to a different project or uh, they RTO into something else. Uh, so it's, it's a bit of a minefield. And that's why most retail lay investors probably need to follow some newsletter writers that they know and trust. Happen to know one. Um, what's the best way to follow you, Mickey? MercenaryGeologist.com, free subscription newsletter, sponsor model. I've got skin in the game and everything I pick. Uh, you can sign up for free, go to my website and punch the button below my mugshot that says sign up here and you give us a name. We prefer your real name, doesn't have to be, but you got to give us a real email address and then you get my stock picks for free. We also run a very robust Twitter feed, 63,000 followers at Mercenary Geo. Well, there you have it. If you need some help, folks, mercenarygeologist.com. Thanks for the time, Mickey. Thanks a lot, Rob.